single nucleotide polymorphisms SNPs, and insertions slash deletions INDELs. Single nucleotide polymorphisms SNPs, and insertions slash deletions INDELs, are two types of genetic variations that are commonly found in the DNA of living organisms. SNPs are variations that occur when a single nucleotide, A, T, C or G, in the DNA sequence is changed. These variations are the most common type of genetic variation found in humans and are responsible for the genetic differences between individuals. SNPs can occur in coding regions of genes, non-coding regions, or in regulatory regions that control gene expression. SNPs can also be used as markers for genetic studies, as they can be easily identified and used to track the inheritance of specific genetic traits. On the other hand, indels are variations that occur when a sequence of nucleotides is either inserted or deleted from the DNA sequence. Indels can range in size from a single nucleotide to thousands of nucleotides and can cause frameshift mutations that alter the reading frame of the genetic code. This can lead to a change in the amino acid sequence of the protein that is produced, which can have significant consequences for the structure and function of the protein. Indels can also have an impact on gene expression, as they can affect the splicing of mRNA molecules, leading to changes in the way that genes are expressed. Both SNPs and indels can have important implications for human health and disease. For example, some SNPs are associated with an increased risk of developing certain diseases, such as Alzheimer's disease or cancer, while others are protective against these diseases. Indels can also be involved in the development of genetic disorders, such as cystic fibrosis, which is caused by a 3-nucleotide deletion in the CFTR gene. In conclusion, SNPs and indels are two types of genetic variations that are commonly found in the DNA of living organisms. These variations can have important implications for human health and disease, and are a major focus of genetic research. Understanding the effects of these variations on gene expression and protein function can provide important insights into the mechanisms underlying genetic diseases, and may lead to the development of new treatments and therapies. Thanks for watching this video. Remember to like and share our videos, and leave your comments below. We'd love to hear from you.